a horror spice where everything's nice. I'm horror spice. And this is horror spice. And today, out of request from Horrific Nightmares JM, we're bringing you Starship Troopers trilogy. We're doing this a little different. We're going to give you a review of each movie, and we're going to pair those with different food items. Now. Starship Troopers Trilogy is a DVD set, comes with digital copy, uh, not a lot of uh, chills and thrills when it comes to this one, as far as uh, the descriptions or anything, but there's the back and there's the front. Starship Troopers. From the director of Total Recall and Basic Instinct. For the bridge of the fleet battle station, Tai Gangoria, uh, with the sweeping galactic views to the desolate Terran of planets Klin Dothu, teeming with shrieking, fire-spitting, brain-sucking special effects creatures, acclaimed director Paul Verhoeven crafts a dazzling epic based on Robert A. Henlin's classic sci-fi adventure. Casper Von Dien, Diana Meir, Denise Richards, Jake Busey, Neil Patrick Harris, Patrick Muldoon, and Michael Ironside star in this courageous soldiers with travel to the distinct and desolate Klinduthu system with the ultimate showdown between the species. Uh, you get uh, the bonus digital copy, director and cast commentary, commentary with Paul Verhoeven and Ed Numir, the making of Starship Troopers and deleted scenes. This is rated R, and this is from 97. And we're pairing that with Honey Racha. Honey Racha is a Heinz new item. It, apparently it's honey and sriracha. Uh, serving size is two tablespoons. It's got 70 calories. Uh, it's got 340 milligrams of sodium. It's got 17 grams of total carbs. It's got 15 grams of sugars. Jesus. It's got a bunch of list of stuff on the ingredients that I don't feel like going through. It's a smorgasbord of stuff. Oh. Well, <laughs> that came out. No <laughs> way. I'm going to have to be real careful here. Ah! Hey, Minnie. Go get a towel. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that was a disaster, but it was it's delicious. <laughs> What'd you think of the movie? Oh, I loved the movie. The movie was great. Um, it's one of my favorite movies. Um, it's so campy. This is one of my favorite campy. And it's gory. And it's gory. It's bloody. It's a whole lot of action. It can get really intense. And I really like that. Then, um, as you know, or some of you who are new to the channel will find out, that I am a creature feature. So these creatures were just... It was great. It was great, and I thought the CGI was done really well for its time. And, you know, if you're looking for a fun time that you don't have to completely think out, and you just want to have a fun time with your friends, um, 
this is this is the movie. This is great. Mm -hmm. Um, I enjoy this movie over and over again over the years. Uh, every chance I get to watch it, I do. Um, in my opinion, uh, the acting was right where it needed to be for this movie. And uh, the special effects were always on point uh, throughout all the movies. Um, honestly, it's a well-rounded movie. If you haven't seen it, I hope you enjoy it. Special Edition Stormship Troopers 2, Hero of the uh, Federation. In this rapid fire sequel to the cult favorite, the Federation's best mobile infantry unit goes back into action against the Bug Horde. But this time the bugs are waiting for them, trapped on a remote outpost light years from the nearest reinforcements, a small group of soldiers fights an enemy smarter and more cunning than any of their ever faced. Uh, now they must join forces with the infamous traitor of the Federation with they are to have any hope. And it's not just their lives at stake, it's the survival of the human race and if they want to live they have to use their heads before the bugs do. Award winning uh, Academy Award winner Phil Tippett, uh, one of the greatest special effects wizards in movie history, makes a directorial debut. Uh, the special features are the bonus digital copy, uh, digi director, writer, and producer commentary from green screen to silver screen featurette, inside the Federation featurette, CD-ROM link to Starship Troopers uh, PC demo, and photo gallery. We're pairing that with Slim Jim Pork Rinds Chichironi, squealing hot. Uh, they're 80 calories for a half ounce. There's about four servings in the bag, six grams of fat, 20 milligrams of cholesterol, 370 milligrams of sodium, uh, seven percent, uh, seven grams, excuse me, of protein. Uh, seasoned pork rinds. Just seems to be seasoned pork rinds. There you go. Okay. I got a big one. And there we go. It's a little bit less than uh, um, flaming hot, spicy, and uh, it doesn't overwhelm or overpower uh, the taste of the uh, pork rind. It was really good. It was really good. Yeah, that's more like a light pepper taste. Yeah. Light hot sauce taste. So on Starship's trip or two, um, the hero of the Federation. That got quite interesting. You want to see because um, in the first movie, you saw quite a lot of bugs, but in the second one, you see new bugs. So, and there's still a lot of bugs. <laughs> so, it's really fun. I mean, things get invaded. Bases get torn down by the bugs. There's a, there's a lot of action. There's a little bit more of a intrigue on this one. Um, the ending is... Is a little sad, but um, 
I think you would really like it compared to the first one. It's just different. It's not that um, it's better or worse. It's just really different because this is after, you know, humans have been there for a little while on that planet still fighting the bugs. But um, I would definitely watch this. Uh, to me, um, unlike the first story, um, you get uh, more of a look uh, in what uh, the people are thinking and uh, how they're feeling in the uh, whole situation. Um, I think that uh, was a nice approach to this film. Uh, special effects were on point. Uh, highly recommend. Highly recommend. Uh, our last one is Starship Troopers 3 Marauder. Starship Troopers 3 Marauder explo explodes with mind blowing. Man on Bug Combat. Colonel John Rico is back to lead his team on a secret mission to rescue a small crew of troopers stranded on the remote planet OM-1. Uh, battling bugs both new and old, the new Marauder advanced weapons technology may be their only hope against the ter uh, treasonous element operating within the Federation itself as Captain Lola Beck and the rest of the Starship crew fight to survive in the harsh conditions it begins to dawn on them that something on OM-1 is very very wrong this time the bugs have a secret weapon and they could destroy humanity join the mobile infantry and the intergalactic action-packed adventure. Special features are Evolution, the Bugs of Starship Troopers 3 Marauder featurette, Enlist Marauder's Mobile Infantry featurette, Music Video, It's a Good Day to Die extended version, Filmmaker Commentary, Director and Cast Commentary with Writer-Director uh, and Actors Casper Dean and Julian Balak. This is rated R, and this one's from 2008. It's 105 minutes long. And we're pairing that with Famous Dave's Signature Spicy Pickle Spears. Uh, my Signature Spicy Hellfire Pickle Spears are a tongue-tingling compliment to all sandwiches, hot dogs, and burgers. Refrigerate after opening... Uh, there is 25 calories per serving. One serving is one ounce. 7% uh, of 170 milligrams of sodium. 6 grams of carbs. 5 grams of that is sugars. Uh, I think it was a uh, bread and butter pickle, only spear, and <laughs> Woo! went down the wrong pipe. Yeah, it went up my nose. <laughs> wow, don't let it go up your nose. 
It wasn't spicy before then. <laughs> ah. Well, to finish what I was saying, um, I think that uh, the spiciness of it um, is more of a warming sensation than anything. But uh, the flavor is delicious. And uh, how many of you out there, I got a question, how many of you out there drink pickle juice? I do. What'd you think of the movie? Well, um, first about the pickles, I thought, um, I thought it was a real warming sensation until it went up to my nose, but it was like a sweet and spicy mix. Mm -hmm. So it's not just spicy, it's sweet too. So it's got a really nice balance. Oh God, this movie, this is so, it's so funny if you like a lot of cheese. It reminded me of those Naked Gun movies with Leslie Nielsen. Um, it just, the cheese was so heavy in this one. It's just funny, you want to watch a real cheesy movie with a lot of action. This is the movie for you. Marauder really fits the bill. And you'll be laughing. Yeah. Laughing and then on edge of your seat at times. So it goes back and forth between the two. So. Definitely watch this one if you're in that mood. This was the introduction to the bomb bugs. Uh, they looked uh, kind of like armadillos. They, they came in bouncing like balls. And then all of a sudden they grabbed suction and stayed in place opened up and electricity and then a boom and people were blown to bits and arms were missing and it was a great those are great um the music video i mentioned in the special features you better learn to love that you're going to hear it and hear it and hear it <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> I forgot about that. How how could I forget? Oh boy, the I think the directors and the writers really just had a lot of fun with this movie. Just really said, okay, what this is gonna be the last one? Let's make it full of cheese. Let's do whatever we want. This was great. Well, this uh, technically wasn't the last one. There was the anime. Oh, but still, yeah. this is... Yeah, the, the live action, as far as I know, this is the last one. Um, comment down below. Which one sounds the best to you? Um, comment down below what you thought of us making a mess on ourselves. I'm going to have to <laughs> clean up after this and change my shirt. Um... Anything else, Dad? No, just let us know. Um, we'd love to hear from you. Um, which one that seems more up your alley? Uh, next time you see us, we'll be on the Midnight Hour with Hobbs, Horror, Have Cheetah, Will View, Mrs. Boomstick, and us, Horror of Spice. We'll have a special guest, uh, Sean. Um, Nice director. Had his uh, hand in a lot of films. Um, That's for Mother's Day? Uh, the next uh, one we do. Well, uh, I'm Horror Spice. I'm Mrs. Horror Spice. Y'all stay creepy. Bye! Bye.